Okay, so we're never asked to solve. I always put down lines either side of the equal sign to keep my work neat. And whenever I have fractions or brackets, I need to get rid of them first. So we don't have any fractions here, but we do have brackets. So I'm going to expand both those brackets. And you can use whatever method um, you are happy with. I'm going to use the grids for these. So there's loads of different methods to expand brackets. So first bracket is 4 times 3x plus 5. So 4 times 3 is 12, and 3x would make the 12x. 4 times 5 is 20, so plus 20. And the second bracket, well, it's minus 5 times x plus 2. So minus 5x minus 10. Okay, and I'm just going to write that out. So 12x plus 20 minus 5x minus 10. Now we haven't done anything to the equation, so I'm just going to copy out equals 52. We're going to collect like terms, so 12x take away 5x is going to be 7x, and 20 take away 10 is going to be plus 10. Okay, this time I can do something to the equation. I can take away the 10 both sides. So it's going to be 7x equals 42, and then divide 7 both sides. So x equals 42 divided by 7 is 6. So now the answer is 6. You can, if you have time, put 6 into the question and see whether you get the answer of 52, which we do.